Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Raptor X here with Good Clean Gaming RX, and today we are back once again on the Planet Crafter, getting really close to unlocking our animals, our animal shelter and animal feeder. Um, and of course, we've already got our tier one animal food. We're at eighty-one percent and change for mammals. Um, so I'm hoping that we'll be able to get those unlocked. Uh, later today and hopefully get those uh, get those put up um, I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna see about um, producing a couple more things to make some animals here um, that's really I think animals yeah it would be my amphibian farm I think is, is still the fastest way to do that um, I'm gonna go ahead and we'll see about getting a couple more of these common larvae uh, one, oops, so well, I guess we can't do that if I've not got, uh, not got enough space. Um, I'm going to go ahead and we'll turn those into, there we go, an iridium rod. Then, what was I going to use those for? Oh, I'm just bringing them back. Okay, good. Alright, um, I'm going to go ahead and we'll see about, um, Getting a couple of these uh, common larvae then, there we go. And producing a couple more of the amphibian farms. Um, I'm going to go ahead and we'll put these over here. That way they can all be, uh, all be added to production. Well, I guess even the production won't work. Heat. Gotta find some froggy eggs to put into there. Let's go ahead and take a look and see on those. Let's see here. Stubbo's at 200, Treasure at 300, Afei at 350, Amido at 400. Right, so that's gonna be our best bet then. Um, generic frog eggs, T4, and a tier 2 fertilizer. Uh, and we don't have a tier 4. If I remember correctly, it's that combination. Good. Alright, and then we just need some of the frog eggs, which... Exactly where I brought those back from. I could have sworn I'd... I'd oop, hang on. There we go. Yes, I could have sworn I brought some of those back, booting up my computer again after an update. So it's it's doing all the funny stuff that it does and swapping uh, swapping frames occasionally. We don't have any. Did I leave those? All right. We'll have to go see if we can find some. Uh, hydration levels low. Let's go ahead. And some water here quickly, although I think, you know what, we've got what we need to go ahead and just make those, I think. Yeah, food level's low as well, we've got, we've got just, oh, never mind, we've got some right there. <laughs> um, there we go, we'll go ahead and fill those up. There we go, Amido frog eggs. Ooh, those ones are kind of interesting as well. Oh, careful. All right. I don't think they've respawned. I don't think they, they do respawn, or at least I haven't been able to find any that do. So I think that's kind of all that we can make from those. Um, I am gonna go ahead and we'll pop over to incubator over here and we'll just see there we go what we need for the generics tier 4 and fertilizer fertilizer and phytoplankton C alright 
let's go ahead and see about getting some of that then. A C, there we go. Perfect. All right, we'll get some of those uh, some of those frog eggs here momentarily, and then we can go ahead and get a second uh, second pair of amidos going. Um, let's see here, tier threes. I've got to see what those are because I do not remember the recipe for that. Uh, there we go, sulfur bacteria and those. Good, we've got that. Sort these. There we go. Goodness. <laughs> uh, we've got more than enough of that. Um, elements, there we go. Alright, and... There's it back here. Got one of those. There we go. Alright. And let's go ahead and we've got our generics. Uh, one, two, and three. And we'll research that. There we go. And have the next round coming out. Um, progress is really, really slow on that. So I'm going to go ahead and we'll see about launching another animal rocket or two. Come on. There we go. Uh, tier 4 mutagen. <sighs> oh, for Pete's sake, come on. Okay, that should stop with the interruptions. <laughs> Okay, uh, tier fours. So we're gonna need some more sulfur. Three. And one, two, three. There we go. So I didn't think to bring any of those. <laughs> Two, three, there we go. Alright, we'll go ahead and make up a couple more tier fours here. There we go. And then we just need... We'll take two of those and two of these. And... Two... Three. through the sequencer again, or the DNA extractor, there we go. Genetic extractor... Oh, we've already got some in there, there we go. Uh, 120, 75, 175. Extract each of those, and then... Uncommons to size, alright. Go ahead and extract each of those as well. Perfect, and we can go ahead and launch another one. one two. Really hoping for 1.25 today. Alright, and then if we 
build ourselves another another one of these there. pressure multiplier Production multiplier. I think that's probably the only one that'll actually do us any good. Um, let's go ahead and check. Oh, there's that. And then two of those, and one of these. There we go. Uh, let's go ahead and I'm going to put this one over here and just see if it produces anything a little faster or not. Go that one there, and we'll put this one there. Okay, so it'll influence the ecosystems, uh, but it doesn't influence any of these, unfortunately. 90 grams per second, alright, so we could take one of the plant multipliers though and attach that. So I'm going to go ahead and grab that one. And then what do we need for a tier 2 here? Same ingredients essentially as that one. Uh, we just need obsidian instead. One, two, three. Go. So we should be able to go ahead and take down this one. Go. And then go ahead and we'll put up a tier 2. There we go. And then I can go for both of those. There we go. And that'll do plants through those and then animals and generation, all that kind of stuff through there. There we go. 450 grams per second of plants and 4.95 kilograms of animals for each of those. And these are getting production times down to 69 seconds. Very nice. Okay. You can use these then for uh, farming some more of the uh, genetics to continue making the animal spreader rockets. Go. We'll go ahead and extract those. And. Another osmium rod. Go and an engine. Go ahead and launch a third one today. <laughs> Get one three. Goodness, it moves so slowly. All right. Uh, another animal rocket. There we go. see here. Tier 2 aquarium generates animals, also oxygen plants and insects. Insects at 570. Just per second, yeah, that's... Hmm. That's a decent amount of plants there too. Okay, let's go ahead and we'll pop in and just see how all of these are going. Let's see here. Biomass is at, uh, let's see here, 13 tons per second. Ooh, that's, a, that's a lot. 151,000 kilotons, yep. That's insects. Animals are at... Let's see here, 6, 3.8 tons per second, which is still really slow. <laughs> Animals are 12 of those, 21 or 210 times. Goodness, we've got a lot of rockets up there. Um, let's see here, plant rockets, insect spreader rocket, 
Could probably do a couple more of those. Those are with the um those are with the bee larvae, I believe. Let's see, we don't have any of those currently. Go, bees and bees and bees and bees. Alright, good. Got plenty of those. We should be able to launch at least one more, if not two more, insect rockets here shortly as well. Yeah, hydration levels, I know. Osmium and tier twos. Alright, we can do that. May have to pop over and see about getting some more osmium from the, uh, from the osmium miner over there. Yeah, we've got only got one of them here, so... Uh, a tier 2 mutagen and a rocket engine. There we go. Sulfur field? Yeah, I think the sulfur field is going to be... That's just way to get over here. Getting a lot of uh, getting a lot of those. All right, let's go ahead and we'll make one of those. Go. We'll put this one back. I'm actually half tempted just to um, see about setting up a, an osmium rod auto crafter or something over there, just to see if it'll produce enough of them. Um, let's see here. We need a tier two mutagen and a, another rocket. Go. And we'll go ahead and put up another insect rocket here. Much easier to make those now. Alright, what are we. Goodness, well, we've got all the silicon that we need now. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and we'll take these in. Uh, should be able to make a couple of the bioplastic. I basically just want to stockpile as many of these as I can. Um, and basically, you know, when the time comes uh, that I can make the. Extraction platform. I'm hopeful that I'll have just about everything that I need on hand, uh, so that I can just go ahead and produce that just about immediately. There we go. Good. We can do one more of those as well. All right. Got plenty of those now. <laughs> Those into there, these into there, that one. Okay. Alright. That's good for there. Let's see what else we can do here. Uh, terraformation is at 1.15 now. It's going to be close, but I don't think we're going to quite make it. 
over there today. Nine six. Insects are going at uh, three point one tons per second, and animals are at three point eight tons per second. And plants are at 7.1. Okay. Now uh, we've got 10 of the plant rockets already up there. We really just need to see what else we can do. Let's see here. Plants, oxygen. So what's the fastest we have for plants now? Tier 2. I, st I think it's still the tree spreader. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and we'll pin a couple of these. Interior super alloy tree bark. Make those actually without too much trouble now. Um, two of those. Two of those. Two of those. Two super alloy. Two tree bark. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to get the ribero trees. There we go. That's an oxygen multiplier, not plants exactly. But um, Hello, Froggy. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put those over here. We'll just do like two of them right next to each other. Close. There we go. And then I'm going to go ahead and we'll put that one into there, and that one into there. And then we're going to go ahead and... We'll get a... Uh, optimizer, machine optimizer. Which... It's going to need one of those, and oh, we're going to need... Uh, Those. There we go. All right. Have to may have to do that. It's more. <laughs> it's more sulfur. Uh, let's go and take all of those. There we go. Well, I was wrong about the sulfur. <laughs> We've used all of that up. have to see about making up another one of those or something. There we go. Perfect. Alright, and let's see here. That's everything for one of those. Let's go ahead and I'm going to get the plant modifier out of this one. Go, plant multiplier fuse. We're going to go ahead and put that one over here. go plant multiplier fuse so we are now getting a plants at 500% 7.5 kilograms per second of plants so 7.5 that will be 14 15 kilograms per second still feels really really slow really really slow I think we can make another one of those already got some more of the uh, the ribera trees anyway so we can go ahead and make up at least another one of those there we go and then is that 
that is still the best that we have for plants. All right. Yeah. Wow, that's... Kind of a shame, actually. Uh, plants, 35.76. Ooh, it's still better to do this, actually. Ecosystems. Alright. Um, bring that back, then. <laughs> and we'll, uh... We'll take the plant multiplier here. And we are going to put that back where it can reach the... Uh, Ecosystems. Because those are much better, actually. I think I might... Might end up either moving or... No plant multiplier, fuse... Good. Alright. Um, let's go ahead and see about making up a couple more of those. Uh, ecosystem. There we go. So, we need... Two of those, two of those, two of those, two of those, water and two algae. There we go. One and there's got to be some space in here somewhere. No, nope. about there we go, right there. All right. They're all getting it perfect. All right. So we are now producing plants at 17.8 kilograms per second uh, times four. That's that's quite a decent amount. All right. And, of course, our insects are going up quite nicely as well. So plants at uh, over 10 million, 10 tons per second. Yeah, 10 tons per second of those. Um, and then insects are going up at still 3 point, essentially 3.2. And those are at 3.8. Okay. 91% uh, of the way to animals. We are not quite going to hit it today. Alright, let's go ahead. We've got a little bit more time here and a little bit more space. We're going to go ahead and jump over to the western wreck here. Um, although, you know what? I'm going to pop back home quickly and just get some water and food. Go and... Good. start checking and make sure that everything is taken out of each of these. Go. And then deconstructing them as we go along. Uh, may as well take that as well. Go. Really bright. And we'll basically just take everything. Yeah, I can't believe how good this flashlight is. It's almost like walking around with a normal, uh, with a normal light on. Okay, we've already gotten that one. With, you know, like, like with daylight. Uh, let's head down here.
as well. Let's go and just take that one apart. And this is back to back to the cryo chamber, I guess we could call it. Go. back into there for right now. You know what? We may as well just take them. I think we've been using some of those. Okay. Um, and we're going to go ahead and we'll head back up to the surface here. here. Uh, no, not that way. <laughs> not that way. Ah, there we go. Perfect. All right, we'll go ahead and take this stuff home. And that's going to be it for today's video. We'll definitely be hitting that uh, 1.25 tomorrow. Uh, but for today, thank you all for watching. And I will see you all next time. Ta-ta.